I'm live. And today is mail day. And today's mail day is a very special mail day. I want to send a hearty thank you to my man, Jimmy G, for not only supporting the show, just dropping knowledge for all you shaving people out there. Mike Vance. But Jimmy G comes on this stream and he's constantly giving us shaving folks knowledge. He's given us his knowledge and he's a great friend and supporter of the show. Now, a while back, he sent me a vintage razor, the Gillette Slim Adjustable Razor. And we've been talking, Jimmy G, and we've been talking, and if you ever get into vintage razors, there is one razor that everyone's talking about. And a couple of weeks ago, Jimmy said, I, I just sent you something in the mail, and I could kind of tell I could tell in the excitement of his message that it was something special. And today's mail day, Jimmy G delivered. So this is a big thank you for Jimmy. So let me pull this out. I've already opened it because I was too excited. But it came in this Gillette box. So I knew it was a Gillette product. And this beautiful note in here from Jimmy. And I hope he joins us live. If not... He says, hey, Tony, just wanted to send you this authentic. What's up, Dan Han? Just wanted to send you this authentic vintage, vintage 195 adjustable known as the Fat Boy. All I ask is that you review it on your channel, which I will do, guys. Any questions, send me a text, Jimmy G. Oh, that's really nice. The Fat Boy. I have been jonesing. Danny K, what's up, brah? I'm in the Fat Boy Club, Danny K. Danny K has also sent me a beautiful vintage razor. And look at this, guys. Look at that. Jimmy G's 195 adjustable. The Fat Boy. Now, if you don't know anything, is that Jimmy G? It's Funky Cold Medina. What's up, bro? Too pretty to use. This is beautiful, guys. But if you don't know anything about... If you're new to wet shaving, why we call it adjustable is there's a ring here, if you can see it. Can't really get this thing to focus up that well in live. But there's a ring here. You just have to take my um, word on it. And it goes from one to nine. One being a mild setting and nine being your maximum or more aggressive setting. You've got the butterfly open or turn to open, twist to open. And your double edge razor goes in there. Once you have the clasp open, you can adjust there's a little mark there, right? This is set on one. Jimmy has no confidence in me. He set it on one, which is your mildest setting. But I'll, I'll dial this up probably to a three to start my shave. Maybe I'll dial it up to five. Levels of aggressiveness, yes. Or you could dial it up to nine. All the way up. But you hear that? beautiful well made hefty lots of gnarling oh this is beautiful jimmy g you're you're a good man and i learned that you don't want to be adjusting the razor once the clasp is closed but this is just a beautiful razor and it's an expensive razor so i really have to thank jim for his support jimmy and all of you guys, I will be shaving with this. And Jimmy wanted me to do a comparison, a side-by-side -side with 
his slim adjustable that he sent me earlier. It's a gorgeous razor brow. John Medina says it's gorgeous. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. I, I love you guys. John Smith. My boy, Danny K. Jimmy G. Sending me vintage razors. You boys are great. But I wanted to really send a hearty thank you for Jimmy. He's an awesome guy. What's up, Rob? And Dan, what are you talking about? A bit of that G.O. Fat Boy. G.O. Fat Boy, yeah. Look at that. But I guess what I probably will do, guys, is this weekend, I'll do the comparison of my, uh, of my vintage razors, my Jimmy G vintage razors, but just take a look at that, guys. Take a look at it. And I've been dying, dying, funky cold. I've been dying to review this and to have one. And now I have one in my collection. Oh, that's beautiful. Again, nice heft to it. So what setting, Danny K, what setting do you suggest I set? I start with? Maybe I'll pull yours out. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a vintage razor show this weekend and thank all my boys Sachin Jan started yours on five so what I want to do is I want to start on the higher setting and then for that final pass I'm going to really knock it down so if I start on five I'll knock it down to one maybe how are you Arvid, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. But look at that, guys. Look at that. If you're new to wet shaving, double-edged shaving, there's just something about it, guys. There's just something about the old-school kind of retro feel of these, and especially when you have a vintage razor. What I like about this is the craftsmanship of this razor. Made in the USA. You can't see it, but I'm telling you. And I think about when this was first purchased, where it was purchased. The person that started using this. You know, what was going through his mind way back then? Uh, a good razor blade, a good blade for the rookie would be if you can still get them at Walgreens you can get the uh, King C Gillette uh, DE razor and the reason I say that is it's got a nice long handle it's got heft to it and the King C Gillette blades that come with it are uh, mild Yeah, I know you, Dan Han, I know you watch Geo Fat Boy, but this is my channel. <laughs> I'm kidding with you. I've, I watch Geo Fat Boys too, bruh. But today I'm talking about Jimmy G, and I'm talking about the Fat Boy I have in my hand, not Geo Fat Boy. Come on, bruh. So again, I want to thank you all for joining. I want to thank my boy Jimmy G and all the sponsors of the show. In fact, you're all sponsors. Just by showing up, by commenting, liking, subscribing. What's up, Zach? Check it out, Zach. Look at this, Zach. I'm not shaving the goatee, guys. I'm keeping the goatee for a little bit. Jimmy G! There he is. Look, Jimmy G. Look what I got from someone. I was wondering if you were going to make it. I am tickled pink. And you know that's tough. I'm tickled to be holding the newest member of my vintage collection. Thanks to Jimmy G. Look at that. All right, guys. 
So this weekend, I'll try to come up with something, something special with the vintage razors. And again, I want to thank you all for being here. Like, subscribe if you haven't already. Share the video. Watch the, watch the uh, ads that pop up from time to time if you're into that. I'm not telling you to watch all the ads, but, you know, if there's something that's interesting. Some of these ads are interesting. Watch them. And um, sometimes I'll even have links in the description box below for products. If you like that product, you can pick it up on Amazon. It helps you. It helps me. And that's a good, that's a win-win. But I've won today, big time, bigly, because my boy Jimmy G has sent me this beautiful razor. And I can't thank you enough, Jimmy. And I will see you guys next time, which will probably be like tomorrow. But in the meantime, you know what to do. Keep pushing play, y'all. <laughs> you found a beard product on Amazon today. All right. I hope you, you buy that beard product from my links, Zach. It helps you, it helps me. But I, I thank you all. And I'll see you guys later. Take care. I think I'm going to get something to eat. This is beautiful. Thank you, Jimmy G. Have a good night, guys. Be good. Be safe. Wash your hands. Social distance. See you tomorrow.